Uh, Yatsi VX7 um, gone deaf on um, the main VFO mode. Uh, seems to be a common problem. Can be main or sub. Um, effectively in narrow band FM mode. If you put it into wide band, although it's slightly distorted, it does still work. Uh, culprit seems to be some IF filters that need changing. Seems to be a common problem, as I say. Um, simple enough to job to do on the back. Remove the two screws at the top. Inside the battery compartment, there's four other screws. Uh, on the, uh, obviously remove the um, volume, uh, you know, the volume control knob and the selector knob. Um, then inside, I can get some bit more light on this. Uh, inside there, the plastic, and inside there, the VFO knob. Uh, you know, rotary knob. There are uh, retaining locks. These just need to unscrew. Now I've got like uh, keys in them. I just used one of those pen pliers. Both unscrewed easy enough. No problem at all. Uh, once you've done that, very gently prise the radio apart. Um, there is a ribbon cable inside it, and also a seal. So. You do need to be semi careful. As I said, prize the radio apart. I've taken this one apart already, so just to speed things up. Um, okay, uh, you need to separate the two halves. Separate it here. Uh, don't pull on this ribbon cable. This this catch simply just lifts. So that just lifts. Let me show you. That just lifts anyway. Oh, yeah, it's easy to lose, so I'm just not going to roll past the screwdriver. And this, this cable will, will come out. Separate this half from it. Move that over. Being very careful with, with the cables, as I say. This piece here, um, this will actually just lift if I clip it out. There you go. And that's how you put it back to full. Don't pull on it. Don't try and yank it, don't try and twist it. Okay, to remove the board with the eye filters on, screw there, screw there, screw there, screw there. As I say, make sure you've undone the locking nuts on there and this headphone socket type thing. Um, you don't need to remove this screw or this screw. Uh, at which point now, the board will simply, bare fingers, Lift out, and that's what you've got, and that's what you end up with on there. Put that to one side, and now the culprits are this filter and this filter. Now you can Google it; I'll tell you which one's sub and which one's main. Um, I'm going to replace both. Um, they're a very cheap part to buy, fifty-six p. Uh, in the UK, pence that would be, uh, they just need desoldering here and here. Um, simple replacement. There is a mod where you can add an inline capacitor to block DC. Uh, that's something I might look at doing. Uh, it's a one microfarad ceramic um, cap. Uh, it's a mod that somebody's come up with. Uh, might look at doing it. Um, or I might just put this one back together and I'm, I am thinking of selling it to be honest because I've got the VX8 now um, but I want this obviously back and working in full um, I haven't got the parts to show um, me actually uh, fixing it I'm still waiting for it to come but I thought I'd do a quick video to show you how to get into it and as I say if you're having trouble with um, very low audio or receive on either the main or the sub channel it's more than likely, and if you Google it, definitely one of these two. If you Google, there are quite a few people who have done this mod, and they will show you which one's for the main and which one's for the sub. But I'm quite happy to change them both, so uh, that'll be the next job. Once I've done that, I will post another video just showing it fixed, but you know where they are now. Um, as I say, you don't need any specific technical tools um, other than a good desolderer um, and a good soldering iron, really, to replace them. Um, the rest of it are just small Phillips little screws, obviously keep them in a little tub, uh, keep everything safe, um, and you should be alright.
um, but it's a quick and simple fix and as I say um, the filter is available directly from Yahtzee via um, your local uh, radio shop for about 56 pence each plus VAT and postage so um, all in all it will cost me a pound to fix it um, but hopefully it should correct the problem and uh, if it doesn't I will post a video saying, saying <laughs> it didn't but it should do so uh, 73